a nurse walks by or something. <laughs> hey, excuse me, family, watch this. Got it down. Now, what happens? Just keep doing that Just more? Just keep doing that more. I always look at where jugglers look. And it seems like you're kind of just keeping your focus. You're not follow tracking every ball. No. Once you get more of them, you can kind of track them at the peak of their throw. Sure, 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 sure. That makes sense. Oops. Try again. Man, OK. Yeah, I noticed you don't throw too high. No, and this is what I do. What, this is my, and maybe, you know, Tamir maybe has an answer. Here's, when I juggle, I always, I'm like going, oh, whoa, I'm throwing it out. You want to keep it kind of in. Yeah. Somebody told me to juggle against a wall. That's what I would say. Oh, Definitely let's try it. towards a wall. Whoa, those lights are bright. <laughs> <laughs> Dang it. All right, you know what? We've got a lot more things to get to, but that is great. That's a great... Yeah, okay. Huh? That's a great lesson. Thank you very much. But uh, you guys want to play a game? Now, your sister's here. Is that right? Okay. So we're going to bring her up, and we're going to play a little game called Top 3. And we have a theme song for it and everything. And it goes a little something. Hold on a second. I thought we were playing a new, new game, but I'll, I'll, oh, I'll no, queue it up. Oh, no, it's Top 3. New, new game comes later. Stand by. Oh, we need, you need a microphone. Here we go. Sorry. All right, should I set, tee you up again? Um, yeah, tee me up again. All right, ladies and gentlemen, it's time. Do we have a phone call? We do. Do you want to take that first? Let's take that first. Let's do that. Here's this for you. And we have a caller on the line. Oh, hello, caller. What is your first name? Uh, Garrett. Garrett. It's Garrett. Oh, it's Garrett, who also likes to call in from home. Garrett, so good to hear from you. It's been a little while. How you doing today? Hello, hello, caller. What is your first name? Doing good. Yeah. Awesome. Good to hear from you. Do you still have your dude hat? Yeah. Awesome, dude. I hope you have a really great fall, Garrett. Hey, Mr. Wizard, Brosif, it's Garrett. Garrett, you tuned into a, a dandy of a show. Glad you're watching from home. And, uh... Yeah, say hi to Circus Juventus. Yeah. Hi there, buddy. Hi. Hi, Garrett. Hey, Garrett. Hi, Garrett. Awesome. Garrett, thanks for checking in. I'm super stoked you're watching today. I'm going to try harder, okay? All right. Half day later. Bye. Half day later. Bye. That's how I say goodbye around here. <laughs> All right. Thanks, Garrett. Wow, it's good to hear from you. What do we got here? Yes. I was wondering if you were coming down. Have a seat. Come on in. What up, Mom? Hey, how are you? And you're just in time for the game. I am good. How are you? That's <laughs> <laughs> the most sing-songy greeting I've ever heard. All right. So we're going to move this over just a little bit. You want to, how about, you, can you come over on this side? In the meantime, we'll bring this with you. <laughs> Tippity toppity top three. Tippity toppity top three. Top three. Not one, not two, not four. Top three. Okay. <laughs> All right, here's how it's going to work. We have the brother-sister combo team of Isaac and Annie. I'm going to ask uh, Isaac, would you mind please removing yourself from the studio out of earshot? Of course. Okay? Thank you very much. Give it up for Isaac. Are you ready to play top three? I'm so ready. Okay, I'm going to give you some questions. And if you, you have to tell, uh, your name again was, um, what? Huh? Will, right? Yeah, because Will actually won in bingo yesterday. Yay. One of our many bingo winners. Here we go. Um, I'm going to give you a question. You're going to name something for me. Will, if you think that you might be able to contribute and help Annie out, you can just yell it out. But you're going to think of what would be the most popular answer. So it's not your opinion. It's the most popular thing. Let's begin. Got it. Name something you need to build a sand castle. A bucket. 
What do you think? Will? Good? Yep. There's a lot of answers there. Sand. Are you going to give me one? What are you going to go with? Bucket. Bucket? Okay. Name something you take on a road trip. Your phone. Anything and everything. <laughs> phone? Uh, yeah. I mean, why would you go on a road trip without your phone, right? Exactly. Name a sport that uses a net. Soccer. That's a good one. Volleyball. Hockey. Volleyball uses a net. But is it in the top three? Yeah. What's something, <laughs> what's something you would yell out if you were a cheerleader? Go team! Yeah. <laughs> Go team? Okay. Name a color that you rarely see a house painted as or with by. What's a rare house color? Pink? Orange. Ooh. Okay. You're doing well, by the way. Thanks. What's something you hated eating as a kid, but now you like it as an adult now that you're an adult? Broccoli. Yeah. Broccoli is kind of delish with a bunch of cheese on it. And with bacon in there. <laughs> That's broccoli. Maybe some potatoes, too. Ooh. Name a word that has the most. Oh, this is a really hard one. Let's pause for our phone call. I'm pausing. Phone caller on the line. Hello, what is your first name? Hey. Hey. It's Timmy. It's Timmy. Hello, Timmy. Circus Juventus is here. What's up, Benjamin? What's up? Nothing really. Nothing really. We're just playing a game, dude. I got caribou. Oh, we got caribou. So did I, dude. Yes, we have our own caribou here. <laughs> How you doing, Circus Benjamin? How you doing, Circus Juventus? I'm doing great. We're playing. Oh, uh, Juventus, huh? Yeah, Juventus. What does that mean? Juventus, it means goddess of youth, I think. Yeah, because juve, it sounds like juvenile, right? That's smart, dude. Way to go. <laughs> hey, boo. Hey, boo. Hey, what's up, Timmy? Thanks, thanks for watching from home. Thanks for checking in. Yeah, no doubt. I'm just calling him from home. Calling yeah. him from home. Thanks, buddy. We're going to finish out our game. Any other announcements? What's going on with tomorrow for Friday? Oh, I have an announcement. The Mandalorian's helping me call bingo tomorrow. The Mandalorian. The Mandalorian? Yeah. Pedro Pascal's here. Who's he? What? Who's the Mandalorian? Who's the Mandalorian, dude? Star Wars, bro. Oh, yeah. Awesome. Yeah. I cool. hope looking for that show. I hope you call in. Thanks for checking in, Timmy. We're going to finish I out our will. game. Hashtag later. Bye. I'll see you tomorrow. Cool. Thanks, Timmy. Bye. Uh, all right. Thanks, Timmy. Yeah, the Mandalorian is literally going to help me call bingo tomorrow <laughs> with Dude Solo. Name a word. Okay, this is hard. Name a word that you think has the most definitions. Like you go to the dictionary and you go, wow. That's a lot of definitions for one word. This is a hard one. Read. I like it. Because it could be read the situation, read a book, read a book, all that. Okay. Mm -hmm. Is uh, Isaac still here? Did he get an Uber? He might have gone All home. right. What would be my name if it wasn't the dude? I'm going to turn it over to Will. The bro? I was thinking the same thing. I don't like it. What is something that you would do right away? What's the what are first few things that you do right away in the morning? Um, brush my teeth. Did you do that today? Yeah. What comes after chicken? Nugget. Finally, name a state you would want to live in if you loved beaches. Florida, Hawaii, Hawaii what do you think? Florida. All right, give it up for Annie. You did very well. All right, let's go ahead and bring in Isaac. Come Isaac's on coming in. back for the second half of the top three. Top three? Yeah. He doesn't. All right, Isaac.
Isaac right here, please. All right, here we go. Isaac is here. And let me tell you something Annie did very well. Now, the number one answer is worth three points. The number two answers are worth two points. The number three answers are worth one point. You need 27 points for you to earn your parking validation from Star Studio. <laughs> if you repeat an answer that your sister gave, you will hear this sound. And you'll have to give me a new answer. OK, here we go. Name something you need to build a sandcastle. Uh, a shovel. Name something you take um, on a road trip. Uh, drinks. Name a sport that uses a net. Mm, hockey. Uh, what's something you would t uh, yell out if you were a cheerleader? Go team! Ooh. Uh oh. Something wow. else, something yeah. else. Uh, give me an A. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> Wait a minute, we're the Wildcats. <laughs> why, why an A? Okay. Um, <laughs> name a color that you rarely see a house painted as. Uh, orange. Oh, wow. <whistles> well, don't get mad at your sister. She's giving good <laughs> answers. Just come up with something else, bro. Uh, let's go turquoise. What's something you hated eating as a kid, but now that you're a fully grown, fully developed adult, uh, that you like to eat? Um, I have to say, probably carrots. Name a word that has the most definitions. Run. Would... What would my name be if it wasn't the dude? Steve. <laughs> what is something that you... Do I look like a Steve? Yeah, Will, a little bit? Okay. Um, what is something that you would do right away in the morning? One of the first few things you do. Probably get dressed. What comes after chicken? Uh, Alfredo. Delish. Name a state that you would want to live in if you loved beaches. California. <clears throat> Excuse me. Give it up for these two. This is a, they, they did very well. Will, Will helped contribute. Yeah. Let's go through our answers and our score. Here we go. Name something you need to build a sandcastle. Bucket number two. Shovel number four, but it's called top three. You need sand and you do need water. You can't, you can't have, you don't, yes, you can't build a dry sandcastle. I've tried. Name something you take with you on a road trip. Snacks or uh, beverages, yes? Number one answer. Uh, your phone, number three. Not, well, you, every point matters. You want points. You don't want to go pointless. <laughs> like unsharpened pencils. <laughs> mm. What's something you would yell out? Oh, wait, name a sport that uses a net. Hockey, number two. We were looking for soccer, very important to have a net. And basketball, volleyball, number four. That's okay, points there. Aww. <laughs> What's something you would yell out if you were a cheerleader? Go team! Number one answer. Number two, come on, you guys. <laughs> Number three, let's go, you guys. Huh? Give me an A. Number eight. Wow. Name a color that you rarely see a house painted as orange. Number two, uh, turquoise. <laughs> eh. <laughs> we were looking for purple and... Uh, like light green. I don't know why. I think that might, I might have to put turquoise in there. What's something that you hated eating as a kid but now you like as an adult? Number one, Brussels sprouts. Number two, soup. Because who, okay, adults, raise your hand if you like soup. Come on, mom. Don't try to be cool. Don't try to be cool. All right, avocado toast probably. And uh, number three, broccoli. Got some points there on that one. Wait, what'd you say? Carrots. No. Oh. What's something you, sorry. What's something you, uh, <laughs> name a word that has the most definitions. Number one answer, run. Um, read, very good answer, but it's actually uh, set and go. Believe it or not. What would my name be if it wasn't the dude, the bro? Number one answer. The bud. 
Number two, and the guy. Number three, Steve, huh? Doesn't even make any list anywhere. What is something that you do right away in the morning? Uh, number one answer, yawn, stretch. Number two, go to the bathroom. Number three, and this is according to me, go back to sleep. <laughs> what comes after chicken? Chicken nuggets, number two. We were looking for number one answer, chicken wings. Number three, chicken strips. But Alfredo's a great answer. You need the one, you are five points short of earning your validation. Final question. Name a state you would want to live in if you loved the beaches. Florida, number one answer. You need the number two answer to get out of the parking lot today. You said California. Number two answer, you did it. You guys won with the help of Will. Way to go. Brother and sister, high-fiving, bringing people together. This is what we do here. Say, so, dude, I thought, I thought it'd be a good time to kind of throw it back to 2012 when uh, Circus Juventus joined us. Let's just take a look at a little clip here from, from that. Cool, huh? Very cool, yeah. We can, look at, we can look at other clips, too, if you want later. Okay, we'll check in if we have time, but we have more acts to get to, so let's pick up where we left off. The last thing we left off was the Diablo, is that right? We gotta keep this show clicking along. Sorry if I, I'm dragging it out. Where are we in time? Oh, yeah. We're gonna do, uh, we're just gonna do some acts back to back, okay? So we're just gonna keep going. You got it, take it away. All right, give me give me a quick second here. All right, is this the contortion? Or no, we're going juggling again, right? Okay, here we go.
right. That was fun. Oh, what do you call those things that look like the bowling pins? Oh, I had something else. Um, okay. <laughs> you know what? I want to make sure that we get everything in. I want to do another act. Is that okay? Can we just jump in? Or we're going to do some contortion? I had breathe. Allah. Say on time. So we have a, uh, this is, um, we're going to welcome back Annie. Is that true? Mm -hmm. Okay. Now, this is what I know about contorsh is that it's, you have to be really flexible <laughs> and have no bones. Be made, just be a jellyfish. Okay, what do you need from me? Uh, get out of your way? Yeah, sure. Yeah, okay. Stay right here. Now, from your brother earlier, I got instructions <laughs> on juggling. So where do we start? I signed up for contortionism 101. I am your student. What do I do? Well, you got to stretch. You're going to injure yourself if you don't stretch. Not going to do it. I'm going to go back to juggling. Thank you so got much. Got it. <laughs> 
Everyone has their own thing, you know. Yeah, yeah, I don't think, but can that's you, can impressive. Can you switch your toes this way? Mm-hmm. Watch out. Yeah. <laughs> no, I think I can. Uh oh, did you guys just hear? I'm just kidding. <laughs> all right, we're gonna, let's get this out of the way because we're going to use the table, and I want to bring out all of our performers for a round. Oh, you know what? How are we doing? I should check the time. I want to make sure we do have time. It is 11:42. Let's kick it over. Let's do another act. Yeah. Is that okay? Jim Gate, come on. Yeah. Uh, whoa, oh, gosh. Hula hoops. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> All right. Uh, we'll just start your... No, you really want me to... I can't... Oh, this? Okay, but quick. Okay. And... <laughs> wow. I think I just broke a record for the shortest amount of time someone hula hooped. That was horrible. <laughs> Oh, where were you 10 seconds? Anyone who debt, right? Yeah. Hula hoop, have you ever seen as many as that? Unbelievable. Well, uh, I, with the remaining amount of time that we have, I want to play our final game. Is that okay? Do we, we have another act to do? Okay, great. This is perfect. I'm going to, this game is so new. It is so fresh. It can only be called one thing, and that's called the new, new game. Okay, so here's how it's going to work. Um, 
I'll get all of the performers, and everybody gets um, on both sides of me. So two on this side, two on that side, okay? All right. I'm going to deal out these cards. You all get five of these. Let me just kind of... Eh, eh. So one, two... Eh, eh. I should have done this in advance. How about that? <laughs> Three, four, five. Two, three, four, five. Now, we have a little bit of an audience here, and here's how it's going to work. I'm going to flip over a black card, okay? And y'all are going to, uh, it is going to need to be uh, a blank. You're going to have to fill it in with one of your white cards. Whatever answer is the funniest or the best, when we'll poll our audience, you get to keep the black card, and that is a point. Here we go, everybody. The first one prompt is, no, I already did that one. Let's do this one. <clears throat> run, run, as fast as you can. You can't catch me. I'm blank. So, oh, I need five. Five. I got your best answer. Ca run, run, as fast as you can. You can't catch me. I'm... Okay. Put your answers in. All right. I'm going to move this up a little bit. We're going to mix them up, and here we go. You can't catch me. I'm... Drinking a whole bottle of ranch. <laughs> you can't catch me. I'm the humble earthworm. You can't catch me. I'm freeing all the animals from the zoo. Okay. You can't catch me. I'm my parents. <laughs> Not sure how that plays out, but finally, you can't catch me. I'm Shrek. <laughs> All right, take a good look. We have, who likes drinking a whole bottle of ranch? Okay, yeah. How about the humble earthworm? Uh -huh. Okay, a few, yeah, okay. Freeing all the animals from the zoo. Yeah. Okay, you can't catch me because I'm in. You can't catch me, I'm my parents. <laughs> and finally, you can't catch me, I'm Shrek. Gosh, I think, was it my parents? Or, no, it's freeing all the animals from the zoo. Is that the one? I think that's it. Who claims that one? Oh, Tamir, you get the card. Everybody gets one more. Here we go. Next prompt is, I don't really know what my j mom's job is, but I think it has something to do with blank. Okay? I don't know. All right. Here we go, mixing, 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 here we go. I don't really know what my mom's job is, but I do think it has something to do with playing trumpet for the mayor. <laughs> I think my mom's has, job has something to do with making the bees angry. I think it has something to do with complaining. <laughs> something to do with a black hole. <laughs> okay. And finally, my mom's has job has something to do with the doll that watches me sleep. <laughs> All right, who likes playing trumpet for the mayor? That's a good one. No votes? Just go by raise a hand. Making the bees angry. No? Okay, complaining. That's going to probably win. A black hole? No, you can vote more than once. We'll just see how it does. And then the doll that watches me sleep. And the winner is complaining. Who's what? Who did complaining? Oh. Tamir. Hey. Do you want to come in and watch with us? Are you got, Are you guys leaving? Oh, that, I'll get, catch up with you in a second. Right? We're gonna wrap this up. But yes, we are getting a very nice donation through a friend of ours, Flynn. Right? Awesome. But you're more than welcome to come in and relax if you want. Okay, everybody gets another one, right? Oh my gosh, Tamir, we got to take him down, you guys. <laughs> All right, our next prompt, here we go. Welcome, we're glad you're here. Now sit back, relax, and enjoy blank. Okay, mixing, mixing, here we go. Welcome, we're glad you're here. Now sit back, relax, and enjoy only beans. <laughs> Uh, sit back, relax, and enjoy a huge honking carrot. All right. Uh, enjoy silence. Uh, sit back, relax, and enjoy the country of Bolivia. Okay. Uh, sit back, relax, and enjoy 
Running full speed into a wall. <laughs> All right. All right, let's start. Only beans. Sit back, relax, and enjoy only beans. Sit back and relax and enjoy a huge honking carrot. Yeah. Oh, thank you. All right. Uh, silence. Sit back, relax, and enjoy silence. All right. Uh, sit back and enjoy the country of Bolivia. <laughs> oh, that's a good one. So, uh, running at full speed into the wall. All right. I think it's pretty close, but we're going to go with running at full speed into the wall. Who, whose is that? Oh, Isaac on the board. All right. Everybody gets one more. Here we go. Here we go. We got to get one, you guys. Come on. All right. I need one. And our next prompt. Here we go. Ladies and gentlemen, I have discovered something amazing. I have discovered blank. All of my, what? <laughs> no, uh, all right, fine. When are bad for this one? All right, here we go. Uh, I have just discovered hot gossip. <laughs> I have just discovered pirate music. I have just discovered respecting personal boundaries. <laughs> Whoops, I have just discovered total world domination. And finally, I've just discovered a 40-piece chicken nuggets. <laughs> All right, hot gossip. Couple of votes, okay. Pirate music. That's fun. I kind of like that one. All right. Respecting personal boundaries. I think we'll just say that one won. Who's, who's is that? Oh, that was Annie? Okay, take your black card. All right, everybody needs one more. There you go, and here you go. All right, our next prompt. How are we doing on time, Dubs? What do we got? got about five minutes. Okay, here we go. Foolish child, did you think you could escape from blank? <laughs> Mine makes me laugh. I don't know. I just, I, uh, I'm laughing at my own. That's, that's good. That's good. Foolish child, did you think you could escape from a bear? <laughs> oh my. Did you think you could escape from getting launched into space? Did you think that you could escape from Beyonce? <laughs> you think you could escape from this pumpkin? <laughs> and did you, hey, this is, did, did you think you could escape from cavities? <laughs> They're, these are all great. This is the best round. All right. Did you think you could escape from a bear? Vote, votes. Okay, how about getting launched into space? It's good one, it's good one, okay. How about Beyonce? Oh, okay, how about this pumpkin? All right, that's got a few, that's got a few. And finally, cavities. Cavities is gonna win, whose is cavities? Tamir! Cleaning house, dude, all right. One extra, one extra, we'll make this. Looks my, like my turn. It's your turn to win. It's your turn to win. Here we go. My turn to win. What the heck? All right. The aliens are here. They want blank. The aliens are here. They want blank. All right. Here we go. The aliens are here. They want mom's spaghetti. <laughs> The aliens are here. They want likes. <laughs> the aliens are here. They want a fake kid made out of wood. <laughs> All right. They want 14 cheeseburgers, six large fries, and a medium Sprite. <laughs> and finally, a balloon filled with chili. <laughs> These are all great. Okay, let's vote. Here we go. Mom spaghetti. Wes, yeah. All right. Likes. Mm-hmm, that's good. Uh, a fake kid made out of wood. Okay. Uh, 14 cheeseburgers, six large fries, and a medium Sprite. All right. And finally, a balloon filled with chili. It's pretty close, but I'm going to have to give it to 16 cheeseburgers, or 14 cheeseburgers. Da -da -da -da. That's mine. <laughs> All right, final round. Good luck. Here we go. Wait, I just put. A, I just gave up my. 
regular. Wait. Oh no. What have I done? <laughs> Where are my cards? Oh, here? Oh man, I have to start over. Okay. <laughs> Sorry, everybody. Here we go. And boom. Next prompt, final one. Little Miss Muffet sat on a tuffet eating her curds and. Okay. Um, okay. <laughs> All right. Little Miss Buffett sat on a tuffet eating her curds and the freedom of speech. <laughs> wow. Uh, eating her curds and squirty cheese. <laughs> eating her curds and emotions. <laughs> <laughs> eating her curds and earwax. <laughs> Finally, eating her curds and a big, and I mean big turtle. <laughs> okay, let's go ahead and vote. Freedom of speech. Oh, yes, okay. Uh, eating her curds and squirty cheese. It's a good one. It's a good one. Eating her curds and emotions. Uh, okay. Eating her earwax. Last again. And a big, and I mean big turtle. All right. Emotions won that one. Who's claiming emotions? Me. <laughs> Well, this has been a blast. Can we do this again? Can we do this again? That would be great. You guys come back and play with us. That would be so much fun. This has been a blast. Circus Juventus. Now, you guys have any performances coming up? Yes. What, when, when, a, when and uh, where? In December. Yeah. December? And holiday shows. You have holiday shows. So you can go to the website, right? CircusJuventus.org. Dot org. Very cool. And uh, classes. You can sign up for classes. You can learn how to do a bunch of cool stuff. Um, none of which I can do. Can Contorsh. I can juggle. I can also, uh, here, if you want to stand over there a little bit, flick these cards my way like this, okay? And I can catch without looking. Ready? Go. <laughs> do we really have a caller? Let's check in with our caller. Caller on the line. What up? What is your first name? This is Lola. Hi, Lola. <laughs> Lola and Quentin? Yep. Awesome. Do you have anything you want to share with us before we sign off? Yes. Go this ahead. Sunday is my birthday, and I'm turning nine. Happy birthday, my friend Lola. You know what we, sh we should do is the perfect timing for this is that now we're signing off on our show. Um, let's demonstrate how we say goodbye. So I say hashtag later, bye, then you say it, and then I say bye, and then you hang up. Okay, let's demonstrate. Hashtag later, bye. And she hung up. <laughs> Thanks again to Circus Juventus for joining us. Lola totally threw me under the bus. She always does that. Thanks again. Let's do this again. We're back on for Totally Drossom at 2 p.m. live in St. Paul. You could, he'll take your squiggle lines and make art out of them. Cool. That's Bryce. We'll see you then. And also, Art with Carol. Get a packet from your play floor or your play um, room on your floor and grab an art packet and follow along with Carol at four and you can make an art project. Booth met expectations today. Way to go. Solid three out of five. Until next time, everybody. Hashtag later. Bye. Bye. <laughs> The clubhouse, old friends call in to play some games and hoping some new friends will do the same. It's a party in the clubhouse, bling, bling, the clubhouse. Our next live show is at 2 p.m. and that will be totally drawsome with Bryce. We'll see you then.
In the meantime, enjoy our regularly scheduled programming.